Right, YouTube. It's uh, Mike Six, Charlie Tango Papa. I have a look, quick little look at Chirp. Um, Charlie Hotel Indigo Romeo Papa. It's the software for uh, the Baofeng UV5R. I believe it does the 3R and a number of other handsets like Kenwood, Icom, um, and so on. Don't quote me on all the handsets. I know it does the 5R and the 3R. Um, it's not bad. It's basic. You can just list, you got a list of your channels. You type in your frequencies. You type in your name. You can only have four digits, I think. Five, yeah, five digits for name. So you can name name stuff. Then you type in any, any tones it uses. Um, if you're using a repeater. And then uh, along the other side, I have to scroll across. You type in your offset, whether it's plus or minus, how many it offset by, um, and then you can select high and low power. For some reason, you might want to use low power on something. You know, if you live near a repeater, you don't need to use high power. So you can program in low power in there. Um, it pretty much has got everything you need to do. Um, running mine off the USB lead straight into the speaker mic port and then um, simple at the top you click radio download from radio but I'm going to click upload from radio it says Comport 8 which is correct Baofang UV5R ok and it now says cloning and the little green light flashes and then when it's finished uploading everything from the laptop the handset should reset itself all this is done with the handset switched on and then there you go restarts welcome so that's chirp really um the other software available is a b bravo foxtrot 5 romeo i think this is the official baofang software but I cannot get this to work it will just not pick up the handset for some reason um, no idea why this is also I think I would prefer to use this but it doesn't work so that's my um, little look at chirp really for people that are thinking about getting a Baofeng or the people that have got them and uh, are wondering about programming it's uh, that simple you connect your uh, handset up you choose which port it's plugged into, i.e. COM port 1, 2, 3, 4, USB ports, and so on. And then you literally just type in your frequencies. Um, I've got all the PMR ones, because I use my radio as PMR. So I've got the 8 PMR frequencies. And I got them from Wikipedia. And I just copied and pasted them in there to save typing out 446 instead of typing it all out I just copied and pasted them so you can copy and paste them uh, go to the local repeater website copy and paste the information in there uh, or you can type it in by hand so it's nice to have the option uh, and also you can unselect uh, the channels that you don't use so now I haven't got a load I can't believe it's, I think it's a hundred and something program you can program in I don't know you can program in quite a few but um, yeah, I use Chirp, uh, mainly because the Baofeng software will not recognise the handset. So if you've got a Baofeng and uh, you're not too sure, um, yep, try them both. Um, but that's a quick look at Chirp, just to let you know how simple it is. You just type in your frequencies, the name of it, if there's a tone, what the tone are, tones, tones, tones. And then um, obviously if you're using a repeater, you have to hit the plus or minus offset. And then how many digits it's offset by. And then your high and low power. And that's it really. Uh, thanks for watching. Um, it's not a fantastic video. But this was the video. Sort of a video that I was looking for. When I first got my Baofeng. UV5R. Quick look at it again. Cracking little radio. I can use mine all day long. Right. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.